Okay, we are doing, going to do part two of our campus travel assignment. We have finished part one. You see we've got our pages here already. And in this part two, we're going to download an Excel spreadsheet and uh, save out the four week worksheets as CSV files uh, in preparation for importing to MySQL. So let's uh, click to download the spreadsheet. And we can open it up here. And let's enable editing. And we see that we've got a table of a worksheet of offices, destinations where we book travel to, the agents here. Uh, assigned to offices and uh, our sales uh, for it looks like uh, a bunch of sales in 2014. So we're going to save each of these out. Uh, we're going to save the destination tape worksheet out as destination.csv. And the same for agent and office and sales. Uh, before we save sales though we have to uh, format the sales data. So uh, let's get started. I'm going to start with, I might as well start with agent and I'm just gonna file save as desktop and I've created a A folder here for this assignment and I'm going to save the agent worksheet as a comma delimited .csv file and I'm going to name it agent and save and uh, I do want to save this active work worksheet only uh, but I do not need to keep the new format. Cancel. Uh, let's do the same thing for destination. So I'm going to do file, save as, and I'm going to put it into the same folder. And I'm going to uh, select CSV file again. And I'm going to name it destination. Save and I'm going to click OK and I'm going to click yes this time because I'm not going to use this spreadsheet again and that leaves the save settings uh, where they were before. So I'm going to do the same for Office, File, Save As, In Campus Travel and I'm going to name this one Office and click Save. OK. Yes. And now we're going to do sale. And for sale, we need to change the date format so it is yyyy-mm-dd. So to do that, uh, we're going to follow these directions here. We are going to select the sale date column. From the home tab, we are going to click down on the number drop down selection and click on more number formats and we're gonna in the number tab we're gonna click custom and we're gonna replace the type with yyyy mm dd and click OK and now we see the date format looks like this this is exactly how we want it so click File, Save As, Campus Travel, and this is going to be called Sale. Save. Okay, okay. Now, if you look in our folder, we've got four CSV files ready for import. 